I thought you were Lord Jin Loku, but you're another samurai. Welcome, my lord. Another samurai? You haven't heard of Lord Jin Loku? He's a legendary samurai. I'd like to meet him. When will he return? Soon. Join us for dinner. Perhaps he'll share one of his grand stories with you. my dangerous mission. Don't worry, I'm unharmed. Oh, I wasn't expecting a visitor. We're happy to have you, of course. Hmm. Thank you. I didn't realize any other samurai had survived. It was a fierce battle, wasn't it? The beaches of Komatsu ran red with blood that terrible day. We fought at Komoda. <laughs> of course. Forgive me, I'm tired from a long ride. Please, have Nabe show you the bath. We can speak more over dinner. Please follow me, my lord. How much do you know of Lord Jinroku? He tells us everything. If it wasn't for him, we would have lost the whole island. When you met him, was he armed? He gave everything to save Tsushima except his horse. It's at the stables. My bath can wait. I want to look at his horse. A farm horse. Never seen battle. Normal tools. Nothing out of the ordinary. I know this saddle. It belonged to Lord Higuchi. Shinroku is no samurai. I'll get the truth from him. Where is Jinroku? He left quickly after you went to the bath. It must have been important. I'll find him. We need to talk. Stop running, you fool! Stop! Before it's too late! I don't want to kill you. Stop!
I challenge you to a duel. You want to fight me? Yes. It's the only way. If that's your wish, I accept. I don't want to die. I surrender. I'm sorry. Tell me who you really are. I'm nobody. I was just trying to survive. You're impersonating a samurai and bringing dishonor to the name. And you're taking advantage of those women. I know. Please, my lord, let me live. I'll never go back there again. Leave. And if I ever see you wearing that armor again, we will finish our duel. Truth. Lord Sakai, welcome back. Jinroku wasn't the man you thought. He wasn't a samurai at all. Ah, he told you the truth. You knew he was lying? He seemed harmless, and we enjoy having him around. I hope you didn't kill him. He's alive, but he won't be coming back. I'll tell the others he left on an important mission. We were fine without him. We will be again. Oh! <laughs> 
I'll never forget the day he was killed. I could have saved my father. If only I was older, stronger. If I wasn't so afraid. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> Careful, my lord. This path is dangerous. Dangerous for a samurai, but not a priestess. What are you doing here? My duty, tending the shrines. When the war ends, people will need these Torii gates to mark their path. So they can find the Shinto shrines and pray for the Kami's protection. We could use their protection now. Yes, but the paths are too treacherous. I tried to visit the nearby shrine, almost fell to my death. Maybe I can reach it. As a boy, I climbed every tree and cliff around my village. If you get there in one piece, Pray for our island, and take an Omamori charm for yourself. Wear it close, and the charm will change your fate. And perhaps the fate of our home. Thank you. Follow the... Gates. They will lead you to shrines all across our island, and the Omamori charms that rest there.
Let's go.
Any news of Tomoe? Travelers have been shot dead on the roads in and out of Hiyoshi Springs. People are afraid to leave or deliver supplies. You think that's our doing? A few archers at strategic points can isolate a whole town. A tactic of yours when you were Clan Nagao's archery master. Tomoe was a good student. Too good. We're fighting your own reflection. We will turn that to our advantage. Come. How do you propose we find these archers? We think uh. come away. We want to control movement in and out of Hiyoshi Springs. Where do we put archers? That path behind the inn. No. Poor cover, no clear lines of sight. You want to cover the largest territory with the fewest archers. It would be smart to control the main entrance into town. Mm, people already avoid the main road. Archers there would be wasted. A handful of men could shut down the road to the coast. Yes. I would want someone looking over the bridge into town. So would I. The road south runs along a high ridge. Perfect place to rain down arrows. Tomoe would agree. There's hope for you. Let's go hunting. What else did you teach Tomoe? I held back nothing. Including why you left Clan Nago? That's no secret. It was time to return. What else did you teach Tomoe? I held back nothing. Including why you left Clan Nago? That's no secret. It was time to retire, and the hot springs suited me. But you continued to teach. Not at first. What changed your mind? So I chose to live. But do you regret giving up a warrior's life? Mastery of the bow is mastery of oneself. That is the only victory worthy of a samurai. The rest is noise. We're getting close. Eyes open.
All those innocent, dead. Tomoe has thrown everything away. Betrayed her people. She is a traitor because the Mongols offer power, wealth, status. Things denied her by birth. Tomoe knew she was born to a lower station than she deserved. Now you're being too kind. I understand how they think. But people who sow chaos must be punished. Your way sows chaos. In the enemy. Not just them. The samurai must use violence with their strength. Without it, you unleash endless bloodshed. The point is to defeat your enemy. That's how you end bloodshed. Tomoe told me the same thing. Would you like to see what I have? One more snake nest to find. Come. How did Tomoe become your student? She showed up at my dojo with her father's makeshift hunting bow and refused to leave. You didn't turn her away? I tried, but she sank arrow after arrow into my targets. I had never seen talent like hers. She must have had training. Her form was wrong. Would have been useless in a real fight. But she had no fear of missing a shot. She never hesitated. A warrior's spirit. No. The killers. I didn't see until it was too late.
here and fight! Sensei Ishikawa! You know the name Ishikawa? I do. I have message. Speak. Sensei, all of Hiyoshi Springs will beg for mercy. Like the victims of Hironori now. Silence! <laughs> Hironori Nagao. Didn't he die fighting bandits? It was decades ago. He was reputed to be a great archer. Did he study with you? No. Tomoe is spreading lies. But there's a seed of truth. She wants us to doubt each other. We are all that stands between Hiyoshi Springs and a bloodbath. Then we stand together. <clears throat> we'll plan the town's defense at my dojo. Meet me there and be ready to fight. That's my kage. I can make sure your bow is in the best possible condition. Whatever you can do, I'd appreciate it. The honor is mine. Just bring me the raw materials I need, and leave the rest to me. Faultless aim and reach. You lack the required materials. Very sorry. Goodbye.
Sakai. We must deal with Tomoe's threat against Yoshi Springs before it's too late. I don't understand a fixation on the town. I was born there. Destroying it proves her worth to the Mongols. And humiliates me. But the terrain works in our favor. Two skilled archers can hold off hundreds. Or... We allow the Mongols to take it. Tomoe wins a victory and lets her guard down. Then we strike. Sacrifice Hiyoshi Springs for Tomoe. The sacrifice is worth it! Tomoe would agree, Sensei. Fine, Sakai. If she will attack from the north, we should focus our efforts there. Scout elevated positions, place arrows, and... Listen! Did you hear that? One arrow, one death. I wondered when Tomoe's new friends would visit. If the point was to kill us, she would have sent more men. Or the point was not to kill, but to delay. Yoshi Springs, the attack is starting. This way. If I fall today, promise me you will keep hunting Tomoe. The Mongols are... You two, come here. What is it, my lords? Mongols are heading for Hiroshi Springs. Gather everyone at the inn and stay out of sight. We will deal with them. Yes, my lords. Good sight lines over here. The Mongols won't be able to flank us. We don't have much time. What can we use to our advantage? Not many options. We'll exploit the ones we have. Hornets' nests. Excellent distraction. Dry grass. Lure the Mongols in. We'll make sure you have flaming arrows. Those barrels could do some damage. Take these flaming arrows, and try not to burn yourself or me. Then don't get in my way, Sensei. Get ready. The Mongols will be here soon. 
They're getting closer. Good. Let's demonstrate the way of the bow for them. They're coming downhill. Take them. One arrow, one death, says they. I've got them. More on the way. Help them cross the South Zulu. For now. Ah, oh, there she is. That's Tomoe? Burning the Nagao banner. We can catch her. Oh, she'll be long gone by the time we get there. She's a coward. No. She's mocking me. She knows the last student I trained before her was Hironori Nagao. You said he wasn't your student. Which is it? I was young, prideful, callous. Hironori learned from my example. He led a rebellion to seize the clan and lost but only after butchering Lord Nagao's best men. Hironori didn't die fighting bandits. That was a story to protect Nagao's legacy. There was no saving mine. As his teacher, I could never be trusted again. I was granted the mercy to resign my position. I convinced myself the way of the bow had to survive. But the truth is, I am a coward who should have ended it long ago. You told Tomoya all of this. I wanted her 
to understand what it meant for me to teach again. But like everything else, she turned it against me. You'll never redeem Hironori Nago. And you won't change Tomoe. But today, you saved the people of Hiyoshi Springs. With my new student. I'll need you at Castle Canada. My bow is yours. But Tomoe isn't done yet. We must keep hunting her. We will, Sensei. Draw your blades! Uh, 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 